Farm Enforcer. I'm gonna show you a little bit of a rig today that we brought to South America tour. Here's the uh, backstage, nothing's really interesting here, so let's continue. Here's Robin, our uh, eminent sound engineer. He's gonna be on YouTube now. Hi, YouTube. But you want us to do you have something to say about your mics or your rigs? Yeah, uh, Audix are the best mics in the universe, only buy Audix. Uh, so if you can check out the drum, we have like D2, D4s, I7, D2 on the snare bot, ADX 51s, uh, D6 on the kickouts, and then we have the F9s as overhead. Yeah. Ringing and checking in like vintage Marshalls is literally impossible doing flying shows. So we do digital, which is absolutely incredible. We had this great opportunity to, uh, to get a nice deal on the XFX3 a couple of years ago. So that's what we're using for all our live performances. Uh, we run the entire band through one unit. Everything is like synced up to this semantic from time code and MIDI that runs the XFX. So it changes, like it changes the tone, it changes the the, the solo tone and delays and reverbs and everything from MIDI. And then we have five in-ears, in-ear monitors from Shure, one for each each guy. And we have separate mix through this Midas desk that we're running now that is actually Robins that we brought from Europe. Like Olaf mentioned, we have the M32C, uh, which is a rec version of the M32. And then we have the DL32 uh, paint box where all the inputs and outputs are. I have all my EQs on, mixed on my in-ears and I basically always EQ front of house. So I know all my EQs will work at front of house and I just put open and make a balance. That's basically it. All the rest is mixed. Everybody their in-ears is mixed. They can also access it on their phone. So wherever we go, we set up and sound check in 20 minutes? Yeah, yeah. yeah I, I think setup takes, if I go really fast at it, 25 minutes, sound check today. 10 minutes, it's really awesome to work like this. Especially on tour, we fly with three racks. That's it. That's an entire backline in three cases. That's backline, monitor world, and front of house. This little thing on the microphone works at, now it's not connected, but it's like off until I go here, then it's on. That's the little red dot that comes on for me. That means we can, like, we can really blast the lead vocals, compress it, like put it, and especially since we do in-ears, it's like really well not to have this as a bleeding mic all the time. I, I think that's it. I think, I hope you got a nice idea about how our rig works. So 